today we are understanding two main function in the python so those two functions are split function and replace function so these are the two function we uh, normally use when we are coding in python so let's start and understand them easily and more comfortably so to understand these two function i am taking an example we are going to code a simple problem so so this is the problem statement we are solving today so let's understand easily and as fast as we can so consider an input so basically user is going to provide an input here for that particular input we are going to produce an output so to produce that output we have to use two important functions uh, which we are studying today split function and replace functions so how this codes work let's understand so basically a user input this line in which there is some issues there is some words in which there are there are some extra th extra words are present there which we have to remove Simil uh, simply uh, let's we talk about happily happily is not a word actually the word is happy but there is an un unwanted word il present with the happy word so we have to remove this word uh, similarly satisfied is the word but the wrong word satisfied il is present there similarly with situation so we have to convert this input and print the output as richard is now happy the word is happy and satisfied and with his situation so we have to remove an unwanted il word from the string that's the purpose the purpose of this code is we have to remove il il which is an unwanted character from the string so let's start with the code so i am using python ideally for coding this problem so simple we going to make it simple and fast so first of all we going to take input and print type so first of all understand is our program taking input rightly or not let's copy the input so this is the wrong statement a user inputting in our program so let's check our code is taking the input or not so as you can see our code is taking the input now move to the further steps so now how we build the logic for this program so we know we have to tackle with each and every word in the statement so how to do that let's let's simply make a list of the word present in the string so how we can do that we can use uh, simply do that with the split function so and is the word which we get from the user and dot split function we can use to create a list so a list is print so a list is formed using the split function so basically split functions Uh, split the string on the basis of space comma whatever you pass on this functions argument so you right now the argument is empty where my cursor is present so it will split on the basis of uh, spaces but if there is a comma so the split function will split the string on the basis of comma so now let's run the code and check whether our list is created or not control v so now you can see it the whole string is now converted into list now we can easily tackle with each and every word of the string now easily with the help of list so what is the next step now we now we going to use list to perform our task so for i in list so now i is representing each and every word of the list the way this loop uh, start so i first of all i represent the first word of the the list when i get incremented it shift to the second third and fourth so on so now we gonna check if statement if 
the word il il in i we will check the word il in i il in i matlab il i ke andar hai us particular word ke andar hai agar hai to hum we will use replace function to remove il word from i so i dot replace so what replace function will take two arguments so two arguments will be first argument the thing you want to replace il now il will the thing you want to replace so that's the first argument and with which you want to replace so i don't want to replace with anything i want to replace with empty so il is uh, replaced from the string uh, and that thing is now i am storing into key so easily understand i am telling you this happy il so happy il will be consider as i so il is consider as first argument which we want to replace and this space will uh, represent as nothing after happy so after uh, running this line the word happy is going to store into this word happy is going to store into k and then we going to append that word into list control z then we have to uh, then we have to add the that particular right word into the list so we are using another list for that purpose okay so we are using j dot append here append function is basically used to add value in list so k is our right value which we are appending in the list if suppose another situation if there is no il word present in that particular word so we don't have to change that word so simply we will add that word into the or into the list we are using which is j which is a list we are uh, using to uh, store correct thing so now print j so j is the list which stores all the correct value i think you can understand the logic easily control v now you can see so so i printed the j list which storing the accurate value so richard is now happy now you can see that the word store in in the j list is a correct word not a not an incorrect word happily is now replaced with happy satisfiedly is now replaced with satisfied and situationally is now replaced with situation so we got the right result but now the thing is representation whenever you are going for a competitive coding then you have to print the same output as show in the question so so we have to now represent it in a right way so for i in j now we have to perform task in j first of all we have to create a variable which is of type string let's create s is equal to of type string which is empty string now we have to append each and every word of j in that string then s is equal to s plus i so j is a list and i is representing each and every word of that list and then add space so that each and every word in a string uh, will uh, uh, differ from each other on the basis of space so i am using a space now after that when this whole loop work our uh, our right string is now stored into s and now we can easily see our output so i am printing s now so now check the code again control v now now you can see this is the input which is consist of wrong word happily satisfiedly and situationally and now our output richard is now happy and satisfied with the with his situation now you can see how we used replaced and split function in this program to solve our problems so whenever you are going for a competitive coding you don't have time to uh, uh, 
uh, split each and every word with your own coding so using this function which are already present uh, always save you time that's the purpose so thank you for patience listening i hope i can able to explain these two important function easily and fastly thank you happy learning